Hello YouTube, my name is Nero, today we have some more Madden NFL 18, welcome back to the playthrough, ladies and gentlemen, hopefully this episode is going to go a little bit better than the last one, in the last episode we actually got our first loss of the year, and it was embarrassing, our defense was fantastic the entire game, in fact they basically pitched the shutout. But I could not put any points up on offense whatsoever, and I threw two pick sixes, which are the only scores the opposing team actually had. It was a little bit embarrassing. I'm still trying to get into the swing of things when it comes to trying to air the ball downfield and not just constantly be throwing short passes. But the goal this week is to go back to what kind of got us here, right? Run the ball, short passes, just play smart football. We are playing a pretty tough Houston Texans team. They are 3-2, and two, which isn't all that great, but they are also in the top 10 for both offense and defense. So they're a pretty good team in general. I'm going to try my best to avoid J.J. Watt the best as we possibly can. And hopefully our sporty, nice uh, orange pants will get us through this. All right, let's go ahead and skip forward to when we're actually on offense. And Houston drives down and gets three right at the very beginning. Defense not doing so hot this week, it would appear. Now let's start things off here. I, I just want ooh, I was going to say I just want to start off running, but that double cross right away seems like a pretty good play. They ran seven times and passed four in the first drive, huh? All right, let's try and get Deshaun Kaiser right back into the swing of things immediately. And there's old Cooper Cup. He got hit pretty much immediately, but whatever. Whatever. Let's do a uh, hurry-up offense. What can we hit here? I like the I like the Y corner here. The dropping back on us. Oh, the safety. Okay. So Beasley wide open. Oh, come on. I thought I threw it just as he was making his cup. I threw it a little bit too early. I threw just a, just a smidgen too early there, which uh, definitely caused the incompletion there. Let's try the halfback slip screen because it always seems to work. J.J. Watt, as you guys can see, number 99, is over there on the right. So we're going to try to avoid him the best that we can. Get the screen play off here. Get the easy first. Duke, that better be a first down. He was right there, he was right there on the line. Oh, perfect. All right, first and 10. <laughs> I was a little bit concerned that was not going to be a first down. All right, what can we run from here? Let's actually get... Isaiah Crowell involved here. I think one of the things last week is I was not having a ton of success in the air and then immediately I kind of just defaulted back to continuing to throw. Just trying to force it down their throats pretty much. Look at Isaiah go. Whereas I probably should have just started running. We've had a lot of success running the football the entire season. So let's continue doing that. Isaiah Crowell actually was just re-signed. I'll put that on your guys' screen right now. Isaiah Crowell was re-signed uh, before I started the game up right here. I had to offer basically a 20... What was it? I think it was exactly like a four-year, $28 million contract, something like that. Who's hurt? Who's injured? I wish. There are so many injuries now in Madden this year that they don't even tell you who it is. Uh, we got Beasley. We got Coleman. All right, so it's none of my uh, skill position players. It could be alignment. Oh, perfect block. Oh, if I could have somehow trucked through that. Right there. Actually, they just showed it. Yeah, that was the contract. Done deal. That's actually really cool. They show that. That's neat. He's not a wildly high-paid uh, running back, but he's uh, he's up there, and I think he I think he deserves that money. Um, he's not you know <laughs> we're not talking Emmett Smith out there or anything like that, but he's a, he's a good running back, and I want to have him on my team. Let's look for Najoku here on the corner out. Oh, he's there. He's there, wide open. I lobbed it too much. Ah, uh, I wanted to get. I intentionally lobbed it and you know got a little air underneath him because I wanted to hit him kind of in stride so we can maybe take it all the way for a touchdown. But no such luck, man. No such luck. Kaiser's only going to get better, man. All right. I want Josh Gordon. We've ran this play several times before. So I want Josh running the slant. And it's going to be... Nope. He freaking jumped it perfectly. So perfect. I only know who number 55 is, but so perfect. Oh, it was McKinney. He played that. He, he defended that so well. Um, I, was, I was looking for the post route the entire time. But as soon as he goes uh, for the cut there, I'm like, all right, I'm going to go for the... You know, guy on the slant, and then suddenly he's like, no, nah, we're not going to have you doing that. So same play, firing it in, the Joku, there we go. Good old tight end fire. All right, we're driving here. It's taken a very long time to get downfield, but we're driving, and that's all that matters. We're going to try and get Duke Johnson here on a screen play. I was hoping to catch him off sides there. How hilarious would that have been? And unfortunately, we couldn't get that corner blocked. Unfortunately. All right, we'll try, we'll try uh, something a little bit different here. Let's go for... Ooh. Did I say something different? Let's try one of my favorite plays of all time. You see, I, I'm throwing a little bit too much. We're throwing 70% of the time right now. It's about to be even more than that. 
And... Oh, I was going to lob it up to him as well. But McKinney got through. Man, those sacks are so costly. They really are, man. Being able, I mean, dropping back eight yards like that, sometimes ten, not usually ten, but, you know, between five and eight yards is absurd. I mean, suddenly we're out of field goal range. Suddenly everything is just bad, you know. And we're going to put it up to him. Cole Beasley, he actually came down with it. And we're on the one-yard line. I'm not even going to bother trying to call a play. That's the end of the first quarter. Ladies and gentlemen, Cole freaking Beasley. He's an animal. He's an animal. All right. Well, you guys know what has to be done here, right? Nice and easy. I'm actually going to call the... I'm going to go to the formation myself here. I want two tight ends. And I would like a halfback dive. Well, zero one trap will be fine. We're going to cut it to the left side because I don't want to go up against JJ Watt. We're not even going to contend with that side. We're just going to run here to the left. And holy goodness, are you kidding me? <laughs> All right, then. Well, so much for that easy, easy touchdown. Let's go for a wide shallow cross here, I think. And I'm going to scramble a little bit. I'm going to scramble a little bit. Ah, wow, they're all just kind of sitting back on me. Uh, don't fumble. There we go. We got three of our yards back there. Goodness, man. I can't believe that failed so spectacularly. Look when you run here. I want to come out here with a halfback dive, but we may audible into something else. This is like my money run play. It's been fantastic pretty much the entire season, but with how... They're lined up here. I don't think it's going to work. They're definitely going to drop back into zone coverage, however. And, oh, fumble. And he actually picked it up. And he's, oh, there we go. Oh, he was open in the end zone as well. Oh, that's rough, Kaiser. That is really rough. All right, fair enough. We'll continue on to the next moment here. Hey, <laughs> our defense scored. And we have the ball back on their 23 yard. <laughs> what happened? Okay, we can check. We can check. Yeah, I said we can check stats, even though we're technically like in the middle of a play here. What happened? It had to have been like an interception. Oh, Deshaun Watson's got two interceptions already. Let's see. Who was it? What happened here? All right. Look at old Schobert go. He's a beast, dude. Harrison Smith has two interceptions. <laughs> One for a touchdown. I am so happy. We had to give up quite a bit to actually get him, but I'm happy we have him. Let me consult the old notebook here. What did we trade to get him? We traded a first-round draft pick, Kenny Britt, and right tackle, Sean Coleman. My starting right tackle at the time to get Harrison Smith. And you know what? I'd say it was worth it. He's a young safety. He's a great safety. And it combined him with Joe Hayden and Jabril Peppers. and Oh, it's so good, man. So freaking good. All right. The Joku on the corner. I can smell it. Here he is. He's there. Oh, -hoo -hoo -hoo! <laughs> I didn't think that was going to get through. I was actually... Really, really surprised that went through his hands like that. Just whoop, right, right in there, right in the old bread basket. Let's check it out. Right past him, man. I thought, I thought McKinney was going to get him. Or is it just Kinney? Either or. I'm not exactly sure who he is. And see his hands going up. I'm like, well, bad interceptor or something. Nope. <laughs> well, there we go. Ladies and gentlemen, suddenly we're in all... Oh, oh. All right, they stopped them. They looked like they were driving there for a little bit, and I was a little bit concerned they were going to score. They have three turnovers now. What the heck? I thought they were going to score, and it's about to be 14 to 10, which would make it a much closer game. All right, here we go. Yep, J.J. Watt, man. I can't run to the right side. He's good. Like, my line's good. My running back's good. But he's J.J. Watt, and I have a feeling Madden is just going to, like, destroy me. I want Josh coming over here on the end. I'm going to have Cole go deep, because I think that safety's going to come up. And he is. And there's the Joku again. I mean, if you guys can like keep... There's there's a mismatch there. That safety is having an issue actually uh, stopping him, it seems like. All right, let's go back to coach suggestions because it's just easier this way. You know, you kind of you kind of just scroll through. You're like, oh, that play looks good out of that formation. Then you run it, you know? All right, what we got here? I like counters, but we're not exactly a speed... We're not exactly, you know, the fastest run. Oh, here we go. And, oh, I was hoping to really, like, put a shoulder down right there and give him the old truck stick. I can take that, though. Um, inside zone. 
You snap the ball, man. They're not ready for it. Oh, freak it. See what I'm saying? Just don't run towards JJ Watt's side. Just don't do it. It doesn't matter how good your right guard and your right tackle are. He's going to bust through, and he's going to embarrass you. That's what he's going to do every single time. All right, so we seem to remember the run to the left. Um, but instead of doing that, I like tight end angle here. It's a goofy formation. It's uh, two wide receivers, two tight ends. But this play right here is, you know, now Paul coming across, if not Najoku in the middle, you know, pretty good play. Pretty solid choice most of the time. And there he is. He just kind of lob it over to old Niles Paul. Easy peasy. We have our three timeouts. Let's do a hurry up. What's the mess with them here? What can I do? The mess? Oh, I like the drive corner. I, have you noticed that free safety has been bumping up a lot this week? Oh, he's dropping back now. He's going to look for Beasley deep. We may just go uh, with one of the crossing routes. I think we're going to do that. Just nice, easy crossing route. Call a timeout. Consider that to be like a four-yard run. All right. You should try and air it out here a little bit more. Ooh, I like the Y, the y go here. Najoku's had a couple of mismatches so far. So, ooh, I like that. Especially with that safety bumping up like he is. And the Joku! <laughs> Can you get awake? Oh, no. <laughs> I was really hoping he was going to somehow, like, I don't know, just put on the Jets and just get past them, but no such luck. All right. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Honestly, play action in the Joku, man. I bet you it's going to work because it's... I, I should probably not force it, but I... Uh, he's obviously had some success recently. And definitely not going to work now, so we're going to scramble. Oh, perfect. As he ran over there, as... Was that Niles Paul? I, I didn't catch who, who it was that was actually running back across. But whoever it was, um, <laughs> they, made a, they made it so the defender was actually going to cover him. That just allowed me to run so ridiculously easily. Let's go for skinny posts, and we're going to audible this into a halfback blunt dive. Oh, we're going to the left even. Niles, if you hold that block, we're money. And going up the middle. There we go, but it's probably holding. Don't get excited, team. Don't get excited. It's probably holding. Mm -hmm. I told Dallas he need to hold that block. Now look at him. <sighs> now we're on the 14-yard line. I hope you're happy, Niles. I hope you're happy. Let's go for a mesh. We haven't really tried out the corner routes against this uh, Houston Texans defense so far this week. So Josh Gordon on the corner. If not, Corey Cole. Oh, Josh is going to be there. Josh is 100% there. I was going to say, Josh is 100% there. <laughs> you just saw. As soon as I snapped the ball, I'm like, that corner's money. It is absolute money. That's Josh's first touchdown of the year? I guess so. I don't run a ton of three wide sets, honestly. There we go. So perfect. They had a linebacker pretty much covering him there, man. That safety wasn't doing anything. Come on. Come on. I thought you guys were a good defense. I mean, you're stopping me from running, but that's pretty much it. Should we try and get a score in here? We got 49 seconds, which is like an eternity in Madden time. All right, Gordon, I want you running a slant, please and thank you. Let's look for Njoku here. And it's not going to be... Uh, perfect. Woohoo! Hurry up offense. Hurry up offense, team. Let's do this. So, so it's good to see that we're actually rebounding from that horrible, horrible game against the Jets. I'm like, what if the rest of the series is as bad as this where I can't put up a single point and I just, you know, suck really, really bad. And perfect blocks. Oh, come on. No, fumble. Fumble. Uh, <laughs> Why are we turning the ball over? Need to see here, team. Uh, I just saw, you guys probably didn't see it, but in the little bottom ticker there, you can see what's going on within the rest of my Madden League here. I said Terrell Pryor had a couple of uh, catches. I actually pursued Terrell Pryor. Um, he, was, he was my first choice to get before Cole Beasley, but I could not get the Redskins to trade him to me for really anything. Like, he, he, they just valued him way too much. I couldn't get anything. And we get the ball back <laughs> on the three. Why do I think this is another turnover? Nope, it was an excellent punt, they just said. Okay. Let's just run. There's always the fun of trying for, like, a 97-yard touchdown, but <laughs> what are the chances of that legitimately happening? You know, we're going to call a timeout here. You know, because, you know me, I like to pad stats a little bit to try and make it so my stats at the end of the season are a bit more realistic. We're just going to call a timeout so I can run one more dive here in the first half. That will, uh, I don't know, help out Isaiah Crowell, make it look more realistic. And easy dive. Oh, there we go. Oh, oh, 
What if I would have like got around right there? There's there a bit of a hole. If I could have gotten away from that one tackle. I may have actually been able to take that the whole way. Well, there we go, ladies and gentlemen. 21 to 3 here. Basically, all up to the defense, which has taken the ball away three or four times so far. It's kind of absurd. I'm glad I don't play defense. Because <laughs> we're playing with all Madden, and I'm not that good at defense in general. Like, I always play as, like, the nose tackle. And um, just hopefully, you know, bend but don't break. Whereas right now, you know, we take the ball away from them three times. We've fumbled and given them the ball twice, but those are really out of my control. A fumble is a fumble. We're 13 of 16 for two touchdowns. Wow. Wow. The shot, yeah, Deshaun Watson is 9 of 20 for 66 yards. Lamar Miller's running pretty well, though. He's getting, he's getting over five yards to carry. Josh Gordon on the corner. Why do they have a linebacker covering Josh Gordon? Like, I get that he's not the same Josh Gordon from a couple of years ago, but for crying out loud. All right, let's, uh, let's skip on passes here. All right. And... Oh, they're actually making me do the kick return. This, this feels weird. I'm not even going to touch anything. I'm not even going to touch anything. I'm, no, I'm going to touch him. I'm, I'm, I'm going to run it back as Duke. I'm going to run it back as Duke. Oh. <laughs> Let me guess. Holding. I blocked him back. Well, pretty much the same thing, right? Brax, then. Is this because you're the fifth string receiver right now and you're not getting any plays? I can see, I can see you being upset about that. All right. Um... Uh, what do we do here, team? Uh, things have been going actually pretty well here. Play action power O sounds pretty good to me. We're still passing uh, a little bit more than I think we should be. Oh, Njoku. Or Njoku. Either way, same thing. I'm liking this here. And I'm not liking it anymore. So we're just going to scramble and not get hit by JG. Watt. We're going to trip him and hopefully break his ankles. Is he hurt? He was on the, he was on the ground there for a second. I'm like, <laughs> please don't let him actually be hurt. Well, actually, it'd be great for us, but it seems silly for him to, like, be hurt off of that. All right. We're going to try running to JJ's side here. Woo -hoo -hoo! Woo -hoo 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 -hoo! Isaiah Crowell, he's got that new money. He's ready to go. I like the uh, slot cross here. The safety's been playing goof, like, uh, just really odd this entire game. So, so leaving the tight ends open. And we're just going to dump it off to the running back here. He was open enough. He was open enough. What else do we got? What else do we got? I want to hit him with the plays here. Ooh, I like the huge drive check here. I like, I'm a fan of the deep post. I really am. And if not, we got a couple of tight ends coming across. So it seems pretty good to me. And wide open. How about that? Oh, come on. Corey. Is he hurt? No, he's all right. He's just taking a long time to get up. Uh, well, that's rough, man. Let's try the halfback screen. Let's try the halfback screen. It's been working uh, decently well this entire game. I like to get the Duke involved. I feel like, I feel as though he's, uh, his role has been diminishing a little bit here in the offense as of late. Ah, freaking McKinney had him sniffed out from the very beginning. They've watched the, <laughs> they've watched the tape. They know the screens coming on those third downs. So, all right, fair enough. Well, my first actual punt of the game. Usually a good sign, right? That looks like a pretty good one to me. Hopefully, I oh no. Uh, so I always, I always try to get them. Uh, like out of bounds, kill him dead. Ah, uh, I was trying to get him out of bounds, and but you never want to do it too out of bounds. If you angle it too much, it's going to go out, uh, you know, way prematurely. And we got the ball back here again, this time on the seven. Our defense is silly, man. It really is. I wanted to run right here, but then they gave me the mesh, and you guys know I'm a sucker for this play, so we're gonna run the mesh. <laughs> we're gonna run the mesh. And, dun, 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 and running back is pretty much wide open. But he did not have the awareness to start turning up field slightly. I hate that, man. It's so annoying when that happens. And now we're in a situation where it's a second and nine. Running doesn't seem like the greatest uh, greatest idea for me right now. So, You know, Cole, he's, he's giving you the bumper run. And that safety is def definitely covering Corey Coleman. I think Cole Beasley is about to make a play, man. Nope, never mind. Never mind. But we got it. We got it. Oh, we got our boy Njoku. Go, buddy. There we go. Things are just... We can't really, like, run that well. Especially the J.J. Watts side. But they are just... I don't know. It seems like they're running a zone most of the time. Except for a, a couple of plays we've exploited man coverage. But there is just always a hole in this defense. And it's fantastic. 
And oh, there we go. There. Oh. <laughs> see how I slowed down there for a second? I wanted to see if, uh, if Corey Coleman could get a block for there and let me get a couple more yards out of it. There we go, man. All right. Let's actually, um, let's get the Crow involved. We got to get the Crow involved here, right? Or better yet, Duke Johnson. Duke should be there because this is a halfback, or um, I'm sorry, a shotgun play. Although I'm not sure how good draws are going to work against J.J. Watt, considering he's like already going to be in our backfield. I mean, there he is already. He's like already going to be in the backfield. Uh, <laughs> by the time you actually touch the ball, so maybe that's a bad idea. Let's try a screen here to the Duke, just to try and make up uh, some lost yardage, and they're pretty much all over him. <sighs> the thing about the screenplay for me is I always uh, six. He has six catches for nine yards. Yeah. Okay. No more freaking screens. I didn't realize I was running that many screens and that they were failing that often. But the uh, thing about the screens for me is I always drop back and throw them. And regardless of if he's going to get hit immediately or not, I always throw to the to the running back. Because it seems like trying to throw downfield is just a recipe for disaster for me anyway. And freak. Why? Why are they? Oh! <gasps> he was open there very briefly. <laughs> they keep leaving them open. That was just a very good play by waiver corner that was. And let's see if we can get this out of bounds here. I mean, I mean yeah, oh, that may be too far, right? How's that? Come on. <laughs> All right, within the five, ladies and gentlemen. If this, is, if he's not the Pro Bowl punter this year, I don't know what is, man. I've gotten so many punts. All right, we get the ball back again. Our defense is stupid. They literally, like, they let up that, like, score right away. I'm like, oh, no. What kind of a week is this about to be? But the defense just keeps stopping them and stopping them and stopping them. It's honestly making this series a little bit too easy, if I'm being entirely honest. Because I can have games where, was it the Bengals that I, like, was barely able to do anything? I think I maybe got 7 or 10 points the entire game, and we still won. Because that's all I need to do with how good this defense is. And we're cutting outside here. Oh, oh my goodness. He's got that new contract money, man. He's got that new contract money. Detroit is 4-1 and one and the Saints are 1-3. and three. What in the world is happening here? Oh. I hate when you have like uh, such a big hole to go through, but you just uh, you get stopped. All right. Oh, I should, def I should definitely be running here. I should definitely be running here. Oh, especially with that big pancake block. There you go, man. Who was that? What an absolute monster. I'm just going to keep on diving, dude. I'm just going to keep on diving. I think they're going to keep Isaiah in here, even though it's third down. Nope, they put in the Duke. I'm fine with that. Let's get the Duke his carries. And here he goes. Here he goes. Hurry up offense. Let's mess with him here a little bit. Hurry up offense into... Okay, I'm not super keen on any of these plays. <laughs> um, maybe hurry up was a bad idea. Can we can we skip the hurry up? And... <sighs> I thought there was an intercepted there for a second. I couldn't, I couldn't tell who was coming down with that. All right. Um, why do a hurry up again? I don't like... I like this formation, but like these plays that like I'm running right now are just like not super helpful. Let's have it so Gordon's running a smart deep in. Come look for Njoku. But if he's not there, which he is, why? Why do you guys keep leaving him so open? How? What are his stats right now? I think he's, he's well over 100 yards, I'm pretty sure. Hold on, let's wait for it. It should show us that. Seven catches, 126 yards. Why are they not stopping him? Like, they're just leaving him alone. Like, the whole game. Many people pointed out to me. It's a video game, man. <laughs> Go ahead and put the numbers up. Sportsmanship, not an issue. Exercise those fingers. What the heck? Are, did the announcers just break the fourth wall? I think the announcers just broke the fourth wall, and that's kind of hilarious. It's a video, man. Just pump up those numbers. It's like, I'm not pumping him up. I'm just throwing to him. I'm just kind of playing the game. All right, we got Beasley on the corner. This should be good. And there we go. Oh, ho, ho, Josh Gordon breaking tackles. Kaiser is having himself minus that uh, random fumble there, which uh, cost us our drive. 
He's been doing pretty good this game. Been real accurate. Uh, no random incompletions for seemingly no reason. Uh, I'm a fan. I randomly think Cole Beasley's going to be there in the end zone. Cole Beasley's going to be there in the end zone. You guys think I'm kidding? You guys... Oh, come on. Pass interference? The reason why I thought that, I saw the free safety book, uh, pump or coming up a little bit. Ha-ha! First and goal on the three. I will take that. All right. Halfback dive. Cut to the left. Maybe get. Maybe, maybe, maybe get Isaiah Crowell in the end zone. You know what? We're just going to go right up the middle. Oh. oh, come on with the fumbles, guys. That's the third fumble today. <laughs> we never fumble. And now suddenly we're fumbling all the time. You're like, all right. All right. If he's not going to throw interceptions this game, we're going to make him fumble. He's got to turn the ball over somehow. He's being too darn deficient. <laughs> I can't. I don't know, man. I can never seem to get. Uh, unless we're on like the pure one yard line, I can never seen the run in from the goal line here. We always seem to have to throw it, right? All right, so we got Coleman coming across here, and he's wide open. <laughs> Why did we leave the entire middle of it so open? Good old Corey Coleman. Well, GG Houston, I suppose. And we have the ball here on the one yard line. You guys know what that means, right? You guys know what that means. If we've got the ball on the one yard line, we're going to go for that halfback lead dive. Then I'm going to audible this into a pass play. And we're going to see if we get 99 yard touchdown pass. You think I'm crazy? Some people think I'm crazy. Oh, he had a beat. He had a beat for a second. I think that Johnson guy is much faster than Nicole Beasley is. Okay. All right. Well, let's go ahead and go for, I guess, just a regular halfback dive. <laughs> Let's kind of run it out here. All right, how about 99 yard touchdown run? Oh, what a tackle. JJ Watt, that's like his fifth tackle or something, dude. My man doesn't play around. My man does not play around. And there he is. Oh, there we go. Beasley's a beast, dude. I love all of my receivers, I love them all. What else do we got? I'm just going to keep on running, man. Might as well pad the old stats. Cole's only got two catches for 45 yards. That's the thing about how I play Madden and how I run my offense is none of my receivers are typically going to become like a big Pro Bowl, you know, standout receiver. Because I really do spread the ball around to a lot of receivers. Um, and Joku definitely got a lot of the uh, lot of volume this week compared to a lot of the others. Oh, I tried throwing it to him too. My old JJ had to get through. But aside from that, I really do just kind of throw to... You know, who's open when they're open. Not really try to force the ball to a certain receiver. Because, again, play, being a Browns fan all these years, there was maybe there was one, maybe two years we had good receiver. And that was when Braylon Edwards uh, was good before he started dropping everything in sight. So, I'm just not quite used to having good receivers, you know. And dun, 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 dun. why is he so open? Who could that be on? Probably me holding, maybe. I don't think it'd be pass interference. Yep. What are they going to do? If they accept it, it's a safety? What? Did I miss something? Is it because I was standing in the end zone? when the, Did the holding happen in the end zone? Why did they just get a safety? <laughs> okay. I'm not... Sure, what happened there, if I'm being entirely honest? But what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Well, uh, happy to see we were able to rebound after the last episode where, of all teams, the New York Jets gave us absolute fits. Um, played really efficient football here today, and Joku was a freaking monster. Like, just a wild animal, pretty much. Isaiah Crowell ran well. Uh, Kaiser did not have any randomly bad interceptions. Uh, Cole Beasley had a couple of really cool catches. Things are just going good to hear, man. Josh Gordon got his first touchdown catch of the season. They say we're taking on the Titans? Yeah, we're taking on the Titans next week. Okay, that shouldn't be too bad of a game, I don't think. That's not so bad. Let's check it out. Yeah, man, we just beat them in every single respect. I want to see the stats, honestly, because I want to see like what our defense did to get three takeaways 
We know Harrison Smith had two interceptions, but what else ended up happening, you know? All right, so Deshaun Watson went 17 of 37 for 167 yards and three interceptions. Goodness gracious, man. I'm glad we got I'm glad we got Kaiser instead. So Lamar Miller did fine, but they were playing from behind the entire time. And so as a result, they couldn't really continue to run, which is why they had to throw 37 times. So that's pretty rough for them. Um receiving and Joku, man, so freaking good. <laughs> He's a freaking beast. And let's go check out the defense here. I just swap this over to just the Browns. There's old Schubert, Schubert, uh, dominating once again. And he sacks. There you go. Why is my man Emmanuel here have a sack every single week? And then, all right, Jason McCourty got in with a well, one of the other interceptions. Do we get any fumbles today? No forced fumbles. That's all right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, thank you guys all so much for tuning into this episode of the Madden NFL 18 playthrough. I hope you guys all enjoyed it. Drop me a rating, and I hope you guys all have a wonderful day.